Introduction. Hello, children. Do you know me? Yes, I am one rupee coin. When you go to market, you spent me to buy fruits, vegetables, or any of your favorite games. Let's learn more about money today. Objectives. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to convert rupees into paisa. Add and subtract rupees and paisa. Determine unit and multiple costs of items. Estimate the total. We start with conversion of rupee to paisa and vice versa. One rupee is equal to hundred paisa and two fifty paisa. Twenty rupees and twenty five paisa is equal to twenty five multiplied by hundred plus twenty five paisa. This becomes twenty five hundred plus twenty five paisa. We can say it as twenty five hundred twenty five paisa. Amazing! So much money! It's time to convert paisa into rupees. Four hundred seventy five paisa is equal to four hundred paisa plus seventy five paisa. As we know, four hundred paisa is equal to Four rupees. Therefore, we can write as four rupees and seventy-five paisa. Adding rupees and paisa. Let us learn addition of rupees and paisa. Add fifteen rupees fifty paisa and two rupees twenty-five paisa. Write the amount in two separate columns of rupees and paisa. First, add numbers in paisa column. Fifty plus twenty-five paisa is equal to seventy-five paisa. Now add numbers in rupees column. Fifteen plus two is seventeen. Therefore, the sum is seventeen rupees and seventy-five paisa. Subtraction of rupees and paisa is simple. Subtract one rupee fifty paisa from fifty rupees seventy-five paisa. We first subtract numbers in the paisa column, and then in rupee column. So the answer is forty-nine rupees and twenty-five paisa. Let us hear what these girls are talking. My mother bought these two dolls, one for me and one for my younger sister. The unit cost of doll is hundred rupees. Do you understand the term unit cost? Unit cost is the cost of single unit. So the cost of single doll is rupees hundred. The multiple cost of two dolls is equal to rupees hundred multiplied by two. The multiple cost of dolls is rupees two hundred. A multiple cost is the cost of more than one, and is calculated as unit cost multiplied by number of items. Estimation of cost means calculating total cost of different items. We understand it by taking an example. What will be the total cost of four pencils, two chocolates, and one tennis ball? If the unit cost of pencil is one rupee fifty paisa, unit cost of chocolate is rupees fifty, and tennis ball is rupees five. Now we calculate total cost of these items. Thus, we have total cost, which is equal to four into one point five zero plus two into fifteen plus one into five. This is equal to sixty plus thirty plus five rupees, which amounts to rupees forty-one. Thus, this is estimated cost. Estimate the cost of given items. Summary. Let us summarize what we have learned. Rupee one is equal to hundred paisa. The cost of single unit is termed as unit cost. Multiple cost is calculated as unit cost multiplied by number of items. Estimation of cost is the calculation of the total price. Of different items.